Yo, 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 what's going on out there, Fight World? This your boy Money back with another one, fam. And that's what here is on two big dogs in this fight game. We have Devin the Dream Haney, the undefeated two-division world champion. He's the former undisputed lightweight world champ. And now he's the current WBC super lightweight world champion, one of the hottest little stars in the game. Then we have Javante Tank Davis, that killer that gorilla from Baltimore, the undefeated three-division world champion, the hottest young star in the game, and arguably, the pound for pound, number one face of boxing. You understand? Now, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls all over the world, we all know Javante Tank Davis just turned Muslim. You know what I mean? So salute to him on, on following his faith and, and doing what he want to do in life. You know what I mean? We all live for a purpose. And whatever your purpose is, man, just make sure it's a great purpose and it's benefiting you um, every step of the way um, on your journey um, in life. But... With that being said, uh, we all know Devin Haney and his fathers are Muslims as well. And somebody came out and said, oh, wow, Tank and Devin are now Muslim brothers. And Tank said, I still want to hurt him. You understand? I still want to hurt that boy. Letting people know that don't nothing change just because I turned to Muslim. You know what I mean? I turned to Muslim because that's my faith. That's what I believe in. And that's, you know what I'm saying, what I'm going to follow. So salute to him. But um, just because I turned Muslim... Don't make me, uh, you know, soft on this kid. You feel me? Now, Devin Haney, um, he posted and retweeted Tank um, tweet saying I want to hurt him. So he know what it is. He still want the fight. You know what I'm saying? Um, they have two different walks in life. They both praying to the same creator, you know, which is A-OK. -okay, but it's a lot of people that fought that prayer to the same creator. I mean, they don't stop nothing. They don't stop nothing at all. You feel me? Uh, Devin feel like he can beat Javante Tank Davis. Him and his father been still running off at the mouth, still trying to dog Tank out, things of that nature. So, yeah, Tank still want to put hands on these dudes. He still want to put hands on these dudes. You feel me? Um, Devin feel like he's the best, right? Or his daddy feel like he's the best. You know what I mean, his fan base, they most definitely uh, feel like he's the best, the way they talk and the way they react. So, yeah, just becoming Muslim don't change nothing. Nothing at all. And I'm going to tell you like this. Javante Tank Davis, like I say, that killer, that gorilla from Baltimore, his mentality is his mentality, bro. You know what I mean? His mentality is his mentality. And that's why I rock with Tank. Heavy. Heavy. Because he don't change. Like you say, I'm not mad at nobody. Or, you know, I don't feel no type of way. But I just don't fuck with people who root against me. You know what I mean? And that's just a, a, a natural human instinct. You know what I mean? If somebody praying on your downfall, why should you be cool with them? You know what I mean? Why? But in this situation, you know, Tank, he want to hurt Devin for a lot of reasons. You know what I'm saying? First of all, his daddy running around here hating on this young man 24-7, discrediting everything he do, um, you know, throwing shade at the man, praying on the man downfall, and in the same sense, acting like he building him up. Like, we're not stupid. We understand what Bill Haney is doing, right? Um, then, just to show you that you can't rock with me, that you're not on my level, right? That you just got here, you're getting a little recognition, but I've been here. You know what I mean? I've been here, and y'all boys been chasing me forever. You know what I mean? Well, acting like y'all been chasing me forever, let me put it that way. Because y'all really just made a name for yourself, and the fight really just came realistic. When you became the undisputed champion, you know what I mean? But you and your daddy was already talking about going to 140, bro. Going to 140, bro, right? Tank don't be missing nothing, bro. Just like us fans, we don't miss nothing. You understand? Now that Devin got a little buzz going, him and his daddy, they talking about Tank ain't the face of boxing. They talking about they making more money than Tank. They make it as if they the A-side, like they did more in the sport of boxing than Javante Tank Davis. Just being totally disrespectful. Like, just being totally disrespectful. And I'm not saying in this game you got to kiss nobody ass or nothing like that. But one thing you got to do is respect the game. You dig? You got to respect the game. And Bill Haney, he knows what he's doing. He knows exactly what he's doing. Some people can say he building up a case so his son don't have to fight Javante Tank Davis. You know what I mean? How disrespectful he getting talking about Tank, talking about the team, acting like he want the fight. He really don't want the fight. 
He know all the right words to say to push people buttons to make people not want to fight him. And I hope that ain't what he's trying to do. You know what I mean? Now, Javante Tank Davis versus Devin Haney is a hell of a fight. Hell of a fight, bro. And I want to see it. I really want to see this fight. Like I say, I'm confident in, in, in what I believe the outcome going to be. I'm very confident in saying Javante Tank Davis is going to knock Devin Haney the fuck out. I'm very confident in saying that. Very. You know what I mean? Would Devin make it a fight? Yes, he'll make it a fight. He's a fighter. Been doing this all his life. So, you know, he going to have some success in the fight. But the outcome of the fight ain't going to be pretty. Ooh, the outcome of the fight ain't going to be pretty. Because Tank going to knock his damn dick in the dirt. You know what I mean? So to all y'all out there keep talking about, well, man, you said Earl was going to do this and Earl was going to do that. Look what happened with, 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 with Bud and Earl. Tank ain't no fucking Earl. And Devin ain't no fucking Bud. So quit bringing up that narrative and quit trying to, you know what I'm saying, place these two and those dudes' shoes because it don't rock with me. It don't rock with me at all. Javante Davis is a different animal. A different animal. You know what I mean? Devin Haney is not a better fighter than Terrence Bud Crawford. I repeat, Devin Haney is not a better fighter than Terrence Bud Crawford. And he won't keep Devin Haney off his ass. You know what I'm saying? Tank ain't go through an accident like Earl went through, where Earl had to recoup himself and, and get himself back to shape. You know? So let's cut the bullshit out. All the way out. When this fight takes place, because I believe it's going to happen, Tank go show y'all what Money Brown is talking about. He going to make you mother mothers a believer. So y'all can see that. Oh, yeah, that boy Money was on point. Yeah, that boy said Tank was going to do X, Y, and Z to that man Devin. And I look at Devin face down ass up. And I look at his daddy over there crying, trying to console his son. Talking about, we want a rematch. But ain't no rematch to be had. You understand? Ain't no rematch to be had. But on another note, Devin and his daddy need to quit acting like they're the A-side over Tank. You know? Trying to demand what they want. Nah, nah, nah. Because when y'all was the A-side over Shakur, y'all try to play big dog. Y'all try to play big dog. And y'all try to love man that dude. So now that y'all run into the real big dog, right? Now y'all run into Javante Tank Davis. Yeah, now y'all got to accept what he give y'all. Know what I mean? Since y'all want people just to accept what y'all offering, now it's time for the tables to turn and y'all to accept what Tank is offering y'all motherfuckers. You know? And now y'all see how I feel to try to um, lowball somebody. Period. You know what I'm saying? So at the end of the day, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, look, Tank got a million and one reasons why he want to fuck Devin Haney up. And if Devin Haney and his daddy grow the balls to accept the terms of the contract, y'all go see. Y'all go see. And to everybody out there that was talking about, oh, Tank ain't this, Tank ain't that, Dev go do this, Dev go do that. When Tank hurt that boy, I mean really hurt that boy and put that boy lights out, I want y'all to just get that man that's just doing his credit. Don't bring up no excuses. Get that man that's just doing his credit. And say Javante Tank Davis is just a bad motherfucker. And Devin could never fuck with him. Period. Shouts out to Tank. Once again, congratulations on following your fate, turning to a Muslim. But um, God done showed these boys that you are the king of this shit. And that they can't fuck with you on no level, Tank. None. Not in the ring. Not outside the ring. That's how I want you to do this, boy. Make him cry in front of his pops and make his pops cry too. Straight like that, and I'm on to the next.